Hello friends, my name is Chetan Vardhadiya and today I am going to do analysis of class 10th Math Mathematics Standard Paper as CBSE has released a sample paper for 2019-20 and you all know what is there inside now 20 questions of objective type in that 10 MCQs will be asked 1 to 10 will be MCQs you can see these all are MCQs then 11 to 15 fill in the blanks 5 fill in the blanks and then 5 16 to 20 one mark answer means you have to solve and show the answers to them them in this 16 to 20 question and then in section B 6 question are there in section C 8 questions are there and in section D again 6 questions are there you can see this is the paper so in section D you can see this is section D in that also 6 questions are there now what I had find I had done whole analysis of this paper and what I find out I had made a blueprint for that you can see this is the blueprint from chapter 1 they had asked 3 MCQs means 3 1 mark question 1 2 mark question 1 3 mark question and no 4 mark question so this is the whole analysis I had done from chapter 2 1 mark question 1 and 3 mark question 1 so total 4 mark then in chap from chapter 3 1 mark question only one and three mark question one total four mark from this Th third chapter is very lengthy then also they, uh, they had asked only four mark from that chapter number three four mark questions so these are the things you need to keep in mind from chapter four again five marks look here one question of four mark and one question of one mark from chapter five arithmetic progression two question mcq you we know that from a uh, this MCQ part uh, they can ask many MCQs related to AP so they had selected that only so two questions of one mark and one question of three mark only five mark from chapter six as chapter six is very lengthy they are having much uh, means part to ask you question they can ask you different type of questions for that so look here one three mark question one uh, sorry for chapter six uh, chapter six four mark question one two mark question one one mark question one total seven mark from chapter number six then from chapter number seven four questions of one one mark and then one question of three mark total seven so these are one by one i am going to uh, you can see it from chapter three one mark three question three mark one question from chapter nine one question of two mark one question of four mark six mark. from chapter ten you can see only two question one one mark one and two mark one so three marks so these are the things what I'd find out and what at the last let me show you from this chapter you can see from 13 7 mark and from 12 only one question of three marks so these are the things I want to tell you that 14 again now you can see 14 I was knowing this every year they are asking um, more questions from mean median and mod so please focus more on this chapter 14 only three marks from probability this is one of the bad thing I, I can see in this paper because only three mark for probability students can, can score more in this type of chapter but only and for construction also chapter number even only one question they had done they had given more focus on this 14 and also on eight chapter I can you can see uh, eight six I had seen the questions of this eight chapter little bit different from normal questions so they had uh, every year they are doing this in trigonometry they try to find out difficult questions for trigonometry so if you want to do practice of trigonometry try to uh, solve different type of uh, sums uh, from other reference book uh, and that all let me show you the paper and one by one I will tell you let me show you now you can see in this paper simple decimal terminating non terminating you know from chapter 1 this is from you can say from textbook only thereby so no need of uh, any problem in that or uh, any difficult question you can think simple question so for standard I want to tell you only few questions will be little bit uh, difficult or different from the textbook type question otherwise this is you can say this is textbook type question this is also uh, textbook type questions of MCQ again little bit changes composite number but you you know about composite and simple questions are there in uh, standard paper also 
don't think i what uh, one mindset was there that sir if basic is simple obviously standard will be harder no every year what they were asking in uh, the standard paper and that only they had asked there in this actually the basic paper is little bit i i was thinking the basic will be very easy but no it is a little bit difficult uh, you can say the level is little bit higher than the basic which what we were thinking but standard paper is normal i don't think only few two two or four or five sums a little bit different otherwise all sums are simple only let me show you this is also basic things from textbook you can see this all are look here for mcq this type of question so you need to also and so they can ask you diff different things from trigonometry so always um, focus more on chapter number 8 all other things i had find out this all are normal i think these questions are normal they had not asked any difficult questions in this thing look here this is this only they had taken means if your concept is clear i don't think so for one mark you will be having any problem in solving this type of questions this all are simple only look here for one mark they are asking such type of questions so simple questions are there the level this is little bit different from normal question but you can solve this this is not in your textbook but you can solve this if, if your concept is clear this is not hard question you can say only few questions uh, let me show you look at this is uh, question from triangle and this is little bit different you cannot say difficult but different so if you had not solved this type of question one time before the exam there are chances you waste lot of time in this type of question that what you need to do so only one or two questions are a little bit harder you can say here so this whole paper what i had find out look here this is also simple uh, means calculation this is this question and this is given in your ninth class textbook as an example question they had asked this in 10th standard so i don't think so this questions are difficult uh, standard paper is also normal only few questions they had tried to this question is little bit different from the normal question but it, it is simple only so they had not tried to ask you uh, any hard questions you can see all this this is also simple this questions yes trigonometry so they try to um, means take out questions which are different from the textbook so you need to do practice for this type of questions you can see so only for trigonometry part two three questions which are different from the textbook that is asked otherwise everything is uh, very simple only if your concept is clear i don't think so you will be having any problem in this standard paper so please uh, i had bifurcated simple mean median and mod is there simple distance and aeroplane this is this is textbook based question you can say and water flowing these are also of this is also of textbook type question you can say normal questions are only there in this whole paper only you have to see if that from which chapter how many question and how many mark is there yes Oh, from chapter one i i can say eight mark they are going to ask you more questions from chapter one and more from chapter eight and this six seven also and this 13 14 they are going to ask so you can focus more on this type of question thank you so much for watching in it and if you like my video please subscribe to channel to my channel and please share this with your friends also thank you so much for watching my video